If you're looking for a place that sets the right tone for romance while you're wearing your raincoat, <laughs> Cafe Monarch in Scottsdale just landed at the number two spot on Yelp's most romantic restaurants in the country. Patio or indoor dining? Uh, indoor dining, indoor, please. Yeah. It's too late to book a reservation for this Valentine's Day, but Javier is checking out what makes this Valley restaurant such a staple for romance. <laughs> and look <Hobby>. at you, Hob. <laughs> That's great. I'm in the mood for love simply because... <laughs> oh, he's karaoke. <laughs> Good morning, guys. We are at Cafe Monarch. Look at the ambience you get as soon as you walk into what is now described as the second most romantic restaurant in the entire country. Think about that. I mean, that's up against New York, L.A., Chicago, all the big name cities for food and they made the second on that list. We are joined uh, by Christian Lukowitz. Thank you very much for having us into your beautiful place. We've been here before, but it's gorgeous each and every time. And that's really what you guys set out to do. That really is what it's about for us. It's not just about a restaurant. It's, it's an experience. And we really created a beautiful backdrop to facilitate in amazing memories that we get to share with our guests. So that's what it's all about for us. And I love what you describe. It's about an experience. It's not just coming in, having some food, although the food is amazing. You want them from the time they walk in until the time they leave to be wowed. It's really important to us. I, you know, the way I think of and view the restaurant industry or the restaurants in general is you really have to try to engage every sense in order to create a memory. From the music to the ambiance of the service, it's all here to just share in, you know, creating a, a, an amazing memory for our guests. And it's really important to us. And it's really all about our staff here that we have. They all share in the passion and the vision of what Cafe Monarch is, stands for. And, you know, uh, we can't be more proud of the accolades and the kind of, you know, everything that's been going on with the the guest reviews and the publicity and everything, it's just been amazing. Let's talk about that because in order to make this list, what was awesome, they actually had a formula that Yelp used and it was basically from reviews of people who had the experience of right. being here at Cafe Monarch. Yeah, that's great. So the, what Yelp did to compile this list was they took a lot of keywords, romance, date, love, anything that had to do with a romantic sense of a review and they took that algorithm and they applied it to every review on Yelp so thousands and thousands of reviews and we came up with the second most in the country as far as people saying those keywords so really kind of exuding that romantic ambiance so that's really that's why I love that you know that uh, accolade because it's all based on real guests that dine here each and every single day what does that say that you're up against all these other fine dining establishments a, a, across the entire country and you guys landed in the number two spot it's just a testament to what we do every day you know it, it's really it's not I don't see it as a competition I see it as more uh, it's it's every day you know we open those doors and we're back at ground zero every day we don't rest on our laurels which you know uh, we have to do the right thing every day and we have to come in with the right mindset and it's all about our guests and that's kind of what it's all about for and, us. And that includes the food, most importantly. Yes, 100%. So we have a beautiful menu for this week, a cast iron filet mignon, just a few of our offerings. Our menu does change weekly. It's all based on season, seasonal local ingredients, everything sustainable. Um, we're really all about, you know, good food, um, you know, the best ingredients that we can find to build these uh, dishes week to week. We have an amazing uh, culinary staff that has that passion as well. So it's just kind of a lot of the right people put together in one place and that's kind of what our success is. Well, I love what you do. I love that you're here in the Valley. We congratulate you, you on all your success. And it's important to note, got some bad news for you guys. If you wanted to perhaps make this a spot where you wanted to take your Valentine for dinner, Unfortunately, they're all booked out no. and have been booked out for some time. But Gosh. perhaps, hey, next year, uh, St. Patty's Day. <laughs> hey, maybe <laughs> the start of spring. There so one go. of those ahead where you're thinking ahead and going ahead and booking mm -hmm. that. And by the way, they've now opened up across the street for lunch. It's called Candela's. Mm -hmm. We'll feature them next week but definitely amazing food. So let me hand you this rose now because it's time to put some real stuff. Just don't touch it, it's been in your mouth. mouth. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs>